Hello, hello, and welcome to Clark Sports Cards. Here we are, personal rips, ready to rock and roll. All right. Tom's here. He says, I'm late. I'm always fashionably late, though, Tom. So there you go. Um, while we're waiting on some people to float in, I thought I would do something. And look at there. First hit the market today. Uh, found a few fat packs. It was supposed to have blasters, but they didn't have any of those. So I thought we would take a look at it together of score. Um, yeah, 2021. Never, never really a big fan of score, but you always got to open up a pack. Uh, I fell asleep waiting. <laughs> uh, never been a big uh, score fan, uh, but hey, 2017 score of uh, base of uh, football. That's expensive as crap now too. So anything 2017. So let's rip some. Let's rip some score just to look at it, just to see what it looks like. Um, I haven't opened up any of it. I hadn't even looked at any live streams of it. So I thought I'd just grab it. I seen it on the shelf and I'm like, huh. There was a bunch of it too. So I was like, I just grabbed some about I think I grabbed like six cellos, something like that. That's all I grabbed. I was looking for some blasters. I didn't have any, but pretty cool. Uh it's kind of the basic design of score. You know, there's nothing spectacular about score, especially being a Washington player as well. So <laughs> rip it. So, Sonny Michelle, just some, uh, always going to have some kickers and weird inserts with score, right? Ari Cooper, Ronald Jones. Uh, it, yeah, it's not too fashionably pretty, that's for sure. Nothing glamour glitter about it. It almost reminds you kind of like of uh, Sage or, you know, some of the other type of products. It's it's the, probably the lowest end retail. Uh, treat it kind of like almost like just a step above opening day, I guess you might say, for baseball. Um, but yeah, nothing spectacular about it at all. No, well, I think the only shiny stuff is that little score logo right there. It's got a little chrome in it or a little laminate in it. So, uh, nothing much to it. There's Ray Corn Smith there at Kenya. But of course you always have to, there, there you go, Palmer. There's you a, looking like a little Aaron Jones action right there. Um, yeah, some more kickers here. Uh, it looks like now this, look there, you got some red up in there. So I don't know if it's some type of red foil or something like that. I have no idea. Uh, um, resale market on this stuff. Yes, everything, you know, as well as I do, everything now is bought up. But as far as, as far as grab to resale and throw on the market, no, nah, not really. Um, it's just kind of like, you know, it's got a little bit of upsell to it. Not a lot. Um, I think I checked online. The blasters are going for about 45. Heck, about as much as the darn Chronicles. So, uh, and it's probably because it's new to the market. It'll probably go down to like 40-ish, something like that. Maybe low 40, something like that. But right now, and there's the uh, Parsons. There's a rookie card. For the Lions. I don't even know what these people got drafted at. Um, yeah, Penn State tackler. There's Julio. There's a rookie right there. Now, that's Justin Fields. That's a pretty good one for the Buckeyes. Of course, see if you can name one good Ohio State quarterback that ever was good in the NFL. Yep. We're done with that conversation. <laughs> but quarterback Justin Fields right there. That's a pretty good little hit, I guess. Right? It's a rookie. I do like the way they did in the old school design of the 2021 rookie at the bottom of it. That's kind of typical of the old school score kind of deal a little bit. Yeah, not a big, uh, I have no idea who Parson is. Um, but uh, yeah, not a big defensive design either. But there's a nice Justin Herbert in the next level. They always throw these kind of like game stuff in there a little bit. There's a 3D. Uh, yeah, I don't see nothing 3D about that, but whatever. Uh, there's Drew Locke, uh, Charles Woodson. This is a game face. Kind of an insert. I don't know. Yeah. And then you got more next to the stat line of Aaron Rodgers, another 3D of Ed Reed and Palomalu and all them. There's Cooper Cup, score team. They almost treat this product almost like a fantasy, fantasy league type of sports rip. Uh, Howie Long, there's another Justin, Justin Herbert score team. It's kind of weird seeing him as a, as a second year now. But Trevor Lawrence, um, 
technically that's his rookie card, but it's kind of like an insert more than anything. Looks like get some rookies here. There's Michael Carter um, for the heels. Brown tree. You know, I, another thing I don't like about it is all these are in college unis. Brown, Gordon, Greg Rosen. There's Trey Lance. What was he? Like number fourth, fifth, somewhere in that range. Third, fourth, fifth, something like that, I think. Nice Trey Lance right there. I don't know which one I like better, the design. Kind of the old throwback design right there, and then the new design. Uh, both of them is kind of like you know, hit or miss, right? Um, hearts, no, sir. Uh, Tim Patrick there, Mark Gaston. That's an old school guy there. I remember him. Charles Woodson. Uh, come on, man. How far are we going down the pipeline to put a freaking punter in here now? That's getting pretty bad. We're just trying to produce cards now. Running back, Melvin Gordon, more and more. So I got two rookie cards out of it. I got the, the Buckeyes, Justin Fields, kind of a throwback rookie, and then the Trey Lance. So do not like the college unis. Never have like college unis when you're talking about not flagship, but kind of the main type of collecting sports. Don't mind it in draft and stuff like that. I think it's cool, but when you get into the main staple products, do not like seeing college unis in that. But either way, kind of cool rip. Um, it's score. I have about, like I said, about three more of those. That's about it. I just grab some. If anybody's interested, you can do it. Old school is better. You like the old school? I kind of think I do too, a little bit. Yep. Kind of a little bit more flash to it, I guess, a little bit. So, all right, Stephen. So you're up. Uh, you're the one on the list so far, and you wanted three Bowman Cellos. Check the description. Um, of what you want and uh just holler it out in chat or whatever and uh yeah we'll rip it no problem at all all right so i know you're here uh steven we'll go ahead and get you knocked out i've got five cellos in front of it we'll do it like one two three four five pick your poison pick your poison i have the approves of the kicker and hunter cards <laughs> what's up danny how you doing buddy oh Oh, man. Oh, 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 tired. Mm. One, three, and five. One, three, and five. So one, three, and five. So the middle two gets taken out. All right. One, three, and five. I actually peeked in and opened up one cello out of this um, this morning when I got it. Um, first time opening Thought I wanted to open them just, I mean, it's this, the typical Bowman, but um, the camos do look better. I do like the camos a little bit better. So, uh, how many cellos did you pick up? I left probably 15 on the shelf, probably. And I picked up probably 15, something like that. I don't know. Somewhere in that range. And I grabbed a couple more blasters. Um, I will tell you that every one of these cellos now come with a security tag in them. There's a security tag in every one. Because every time I was ringing them up, it's like, uh, 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 going across it constantly. I was like, man. Because, hell, some of the blasters don't even have this in there. Every one of the cellos has got these security tags in them. So we'll, we'll collect these security tags and ship them off to, to uh, Tom Edwards either way. So, But, yeah, that's about how many I picked up. Um, I like the blasters a little bit better, but I do like opening these because I want to get some of the, you know, camos as well. So um, it's all about the parallels and stuff like that, you know. Um, I did notice in the one cello that I did rip, it's kind of the same design. Um, there is a little bit more. I don't know. Okay, the, the camos are throwing me off. I'm thinking like, there's a green card back here, and that's a camo. But they kind of just give you a little bit more inserts with the camo. And a little bit less base, but there's 12 cards in it per pack, and there's two packs in it, and they squeeze in the camos inside of those. So you're supposed to get, was it five camos, I think it is? Yeah, five camos. So I think they do it either three in, three in one pack and two in another or whatever. So that's about how many I picked up. But you got a little brown eye going on there. Chris Bryant, um, he was the one that got that thing with the Pirates this morning. I thought it was hilarious. God almighty. Santander. A Bobby Dahlback rookie card. Nice little Dahlback. Started off in spring training like on fire. And it's kind of cooled off a little bit. There's a rookie card of Christian Pache. 
And a rookie car behind it of Sixto Sanchez. As a matter of fact, that was in my cello that I pulled. It was a Sixto Sanchez um, earlier this morning. Rookie car. It's a pretty sweet looking car. A chrome of Sam Huff. Number 76 right there. Let's put old Sixto out there. Uh, the Sam Huff rookie. A first chrome of, was it uh, Hyung Ling Choi? I guess it is. It's a first chrome. Or not a chrome, but a camo. Another first in there of Trent Deborah. First, we'll put him up there. He's going to be our little camo as well. James Bede. And, oh, we got a nice little J.J. Blade in chrome. Let me get these fat backs out of the way. J.J. Blade. Nice little J.J. right there. Uh, let me see here. Let me get out of. Got another pop up coming in over here. Let me get that out of the way. Another chrome first of Sanchez. Nice chrome there as well. So we get another first in chrome. Amaya, Volpe, and Cody Hopes. So not a little bad first pack. Got you a camo, two camo first cards. But we're still looking for the top three, right? Top three. What's up, Lewis? How you doing, buddy? Hubert Ruiz is our rookie card. And, you know, there's a trout. Always good to get a trout in there. We're always going to set a trout up there in the stands a little bit. Louis Castillo, Cody B, Josh Donaldson. A chrome of Riley Green. Detroit. Nice chrome there. We get into some um, camos a little bit. So we got, I think it was three camos the last pack. And so, yeah, we got two this time. So Garrett Mitchell's a nice chrome. Beat your heart out. James Palmer right there. Ed Howard. There you go. Paul C. In camo. Brett Beatty. And our last chrome in this is Jackson Rutledge. And then our fillers, paper, are Nick Allen, Freddie, and Vidal Bruhan, which people are starting to talk about him a little bit in the minors as far as possibly popping up. Or if he's not already, already popped up. Um, but yeah. Nice little fat pack there. Not too bad. Who are the top three? Um, I think it would be Sabato, uh, Austin Martin, and Blaze Jordan, I think, are the top three that everybody's chasing after in Bowman. But I mean, you know, that's initial. In, uh, that was the initial, but you don't know how that'll change. So if somebody gets caught up, or somebody gets a does something good in the minors, and then they all of a sudden change, you know, go back and punt. But this, um, which I thought me and Chapin was talking, um, Camo Mitchell to James. Okay, all right. Um, who is that Philly's first guy that is already up in the minors? They got him as the first, but he actually got drafted in like, me and Chafin was looking, I think it was like 2016 or something like that. It was something feel something or another, Moto or Mato or whatever his name is. I can't remember, but um, he was actually drafted uh, in 16, and his first card is this year. It's almost like a Jake Cronesworth. So we're going to put two James P from Derek. I'm sure James P would appreciate that. All right. And if you're looking for your packs of cards, everything went out on Monday as well. Uh, maybe some of them got thrown over into Tuesday, but uh, most of them went out Monday. Um, all right. Yeah, Mayton of the Philly guy. Yeah, he's 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 just okay. He filled in because um, we actually I didn't even know this, but we was watching him when we was down watching the Braves. He actually come in and played and uh, took over um, second base position for a little bit. So I don't know. Um, it's kind of weird though because you're thinking, well, his first card he's already in the pros. I'm like, that's kind of weird. I guess they just didn't print him out or something. Camposano Cunha is always good to get an Acuna. Shane Bieber right behind it. And Christian Yelich, Sean Murphy, and a rookie card of Joey Bart. Nice little rookie card of Joey Bart. Shinage Chrome there. And behind it, there he is, Wander Franco. Number one prospect, which definitely I think will be caught up this year for sure. 
Uh, they've already traded away their shortstop and making way for, I think, him to come up probably in the next month, I'll bet. Nice Wonder Franco right there. Asa Lacey's a good in and Chrome. I mean, uh, Camo. Luis Garcia, the better Garcia, according to Tom. He said he's a lot better. Uh, Nick Lodolo. And Bo Naylor. Bo Naylor. And Chrome. Jackson Kuar. Miguel Amaya. Brandon Shoemake, which, man, he thought Pache was hitting bad. I think he's batting like 109 in the minors and got signing bonus of like 3 million and something. Oh my God. Mm. He moved up immediately from 1A because he was like going crazy like a year ago or a year and a half ago or two years ago. And then um, got moved up to double A and now he's batting like a 109 in double A. They're thinking about moving him back down, but they're afraid he's going to hurt his, uh, hurt his feelings. <laughs> <laughs> Brewers and Nationals this weekend. Brewers and Nats this weekend. Hmm. All right. Second pack. See what we got here, Derek. Got an Evan White rookie card. Always like a good Evan White, right? Travaris. Jazz Chisholm rookie card. Casey Mize. Another rookie card. Casey Mize. Devin Garcia. Jake Cronensworth rookie. Must be like a little rookie pack here. Max Meyer is our Chrome. Another JJ JJ Blade in camo, Wander Franco in camo. That's nice, nice Wander Franco. Francisco Alvarez Chrome, Jordan Walker Chrome, mm. Nick Lofton, Austin Hendrick, which is not bad, and James Beard. Um, in my one pack that I opened, I didn't get a number out of it or an auto out of it as well. So I don't know if they're throwing these camos in there. And it's harder to hit the numbers. I guess when we start opening a little bit more, this will kind of figure that out, I guess. Who knows? Um, sometimes they add certain products and they take away. Uh, just like in the mojos um, or the mo uh, the mojo boxes, you would hardly ever get any numbers or any parallels. It's all about the mojos. They take all that away in the packs. So last pack for you, Derek. Let's see what we got here. Did you see my order? I did not. Did you post it in chat? If you did, I'm sorry if I missed it. I'm not looking on my phone. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see it right now. I'm down for four cellos. Money on the way. Okay, I got you here. Okay, I see it now. Tom. Got paid up here. Let's see here. Tom. Edwards. Four cellos. Okay. I got you. I missed that. Sorry. Um, I if I missed anybody else. Yep. Okay. I got you. I got you. Oh. All right. Sorry about that. Here we go. Uh, next pack. Two packs in this. I guess we're looking for what the camos of the top guys as well. It's weird because we chase camos and we're like, we know we won't chrome more. And I don't know if that's just, I think it's just two inserts basically back to back. But we got a Tristan McKenzie rookie card. Ian Anderson. Now that's one pitcher. I know I'm biased, but I think he's going to be real good. Nick Magical. Garrett Crochet. I'm still holding on to that one of one too of Ian Anderson. Probably hold on to that for a while. Um, there's a Ryan Mountcastle rookie of the year. That's a nice one. Nice Ryan Mountcastle. I love these rookie of the years this year. Sweet looking. Futurist Nick Gonzalez. He needs to be pulled up. About five cent down from the Pirates. Uh, Jordan Groshon. Forrest Whitley. And must have three in the next one. Got a Jordan Balazovic. Matthew Thompson. Podomo. There he is. Aaron Sabato. That's one of the first that you're after right there. Either number two or number three that we want. And Jose Salas. That's a nice one. Aaron Sabato. Oh, man. Baseball cards. <laughs> um, how you doing, Jared? You doing all right, buddy? Boston Red Sox. Probably rain out every day. At, um, pitching should be ready tomorrow. And Woodruff and Burns is going to be hard to get a hit on those cards. Yeah. Wood, Woodruff and Burns. I think I got um, 
I got Woodruff on my fantasy football team. He is pitching pretty good this year. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Pete Alonzo, Pistol Pete, Polar Bear. Man, these, the greens always throw me off back here. Manny Machado, Luis Garcia, the second best Luis Garcia. We'll still put him up there, though. Sixto Sanchez, rookie card. Jordan Alvarez, and a Spencer Torque. Nice torque right there. A little OC left to right, which is typical of these cards, it seems like. But still a nice torque right there. We're going to put him right there. And a Bowman Scout, Nolan Jones for the Cleveland Indians, 43. Logan Gilbert. <laughs> we sit there and talk and downgrade him. And then you get a camo. <laughs> Brandon Shoemake. Nick Allen. D.L. Hall. And a first of Antonio Gomez in Chrome. You never know about these Chrome people. Blake Walton, another Spencer Torkelson, and an Anthony Volt. So we kind of missed. We got one out of the top three as far as uh, first that we're after, I guess. Got a bunch of rookie cards, as you always do, kind of in Bowman. And some decent little Chromes in there. I'll sleeve a lot of these up. Nice torque. Uh have burns yeah oh you've got burns so i must have woodruff then i must have woodruff i know i got one of the two best ones on the team um you're welcome steven uh, but just some of the little hits there we'll just kind of go through them and bust them and i'll just leave a bunch of these up after screen here King, i mean bowman is all you always you might not get the people that you want but it's always filled with rookie cards just a bunch of different stuff to go after it had what's nice right there and i have noticed too if you'll notice the chrome the camo look at the color variation like this one's darker and this one's lighter green. I noticed that in one of my packs. And it's not like it's numbered or a you know, a short print or nothing. It's just like you can see it real close right there. The color is different. Um on some of these. See like it right there. This one's a darker that's a darker green. And you got another lighter green here. I don't know. If it's just the way they come off the press or what or what it is but just thought it was weird when i seen that before uh max meyer wander six though chrome i like that one uh, antonio gomez you never know about that one sabato's nice wander franco and camo you got all the wanders i think just about um Trent never oh, Mount council's nice i like that card casey mize riley green and gilbert sanchez first as well so not a bad little rip no autos no numbers but like I said, we'll find out after we rip a few more of these whether, as as um, Tom always says, is the juice worth the squeeze in um, buying the cellos or not. So we'll put in here Stephen Cards. Old Derek. I'll put your name on that stack. I'll set it to the side, Stephen. What I might start doing instead of shipping out every week, because it seems like I'm always late, and just try to do it every two weeks. That way, if you buy in sometime during the week when we have a break, I can throw them in there together a little bit and save shipping a little bit. I just hated doing it once a month because then it's kind of like, man, there's so much to ship out. Rushed at the printers. Yeah, probably so. Probably so. He's doing very good this year. Almost as good as the other two. Nice paint. Thank you for the light. You're welcome, Jerry. I pulled Jason Amiga's Bowman Chrome car today. There you go. There you go. Some nice little chrome. And rush at the printers. All right. So. We actually have not a lot of cellos. One, two, three, four, five, six. We've got six more. We'll throw these six out here. Don't have a lot of cellos. It's got more got more blasters than I did cellos. Just because I figured that I didn't get a lot. I only got like four. I had like a so I had a few left over as well. So all right. Tom. There. There's six there. Kind of a you know weird other we'll do it like one two three four five six how about that and you pick four of them pick four of them and we'll start ripping tom the four in the middle all right so that'd be them four right there and the two ends will be taken out. So all I've got, I, I should have probably picked up more cellos, but I didn't think they'd be too appeasing to a lot of people. 
uh, just because of the camo, but I guess something new is always appeasing. Four cellos. Surely out of four cellos and three above, we should get at least one number card or one auto, I guess. Who knows? We'll find out. You will take the odds out of seven because we ripped three with um, Derek. These four, you would think out of seven cellos, you would at least get one number or one auto. Um, yeah, because it's a little bit less packed, but I mean, opening seven of them, you would think that you would get a little bit. I think everybody just after the phone. Like we said. So here we go. First one, Nick Magical. Take away the ends in the ones. Um, Nick Magical, Garrett Crochet, got a nice Jose Altuve there, Pete Alonzo, Manny Machado, and a rookie card of Nate Pearson in chrome. Nice Nate, put him up there. Futurist, Corbin Carroll, Corbin Carroll, Mike Togliala, or something like that. There's a Heston Kierstad, that's not bad, and Chromes, I mean uh, camo. So we got two in that, so we must get three in the other. <coughs> Excuse me, Bo Naylor, Chrome, Brendan Davis, outfielder, and there he is, Jordan Blaze, or Bla excuse me, Jordan Blaze, Blaze Jordan. How about that? Let's try that. Nice little Blaze Jordan right there. It's paper, but still a first card. One of the top three prospects, Austin Wells and Helio Ramos. So you're one ahead. Already, see if you can get the other two. Are the odds for the auto on the package? Let's check and see. Probably not. Man, hold on a minute. Let me get this eye extensions out. Oh my gosh. Let's see what I can see on these packs. Uh, you probably won't be able to see that, but let me see if I can see it. Um. Uh, Sky Blue, it says 1 in 44, sequentially numbered. Fuchsia, 1 in 200, 1 in 180, blue, blue, yellow, gold, so forth, and crazy hits after that. Chrome Prospect Parallels, 1 in every 99 packs. It says refractors. The sparkles, 1 in 66. So, pretty good little odds here. <laughs> um, looking for autos, the Red Shimmers printing plates is 1 out of like 12,000. Super refractors, one out of like one, like five hundred thousand, freaking crazy. Um, man, Chrome Prospect autographs. Let's look for the one out of eight hundred and forty-four Chrome autographs rookie. It says Chrome rookie autograph parallels. Green's one out of two thousand six hundred. So it sounds like it's pretty good little odds here. But I mean every. Each individual um, one is showing here different odds. So when you add it all up, it's going to be lower than that. Um, but yeah, it's kind of hard to decipher all of them, to be honest with you. It's just so much crap in there. Because, you know, you take one odd for the green, one odd for this, one odd for that. And even the worst, the, the best odds, it's going to be lower than that. Simply because you add up the, all the other odds. It's going to be crazy lower. But just like anything, it seems like it's hard to get an auto in Bowman. I think we got lucky that one night. We'll be up in like 12 blasters and got like five or six autos, something like that, it seems like. It was kind of a, might have been just a lucky streak. I don't know. Luis Garcia, Sixto Sanchez, two good rookies there. We'll set them up. Haven't pulled an auto yet out of 10 blasters. See what I'm saying, James? I mean, we opened 12 blasters and got like five. Five or six, I couldn't remember. Um, so, it, it just might be sheer luck. Who knows? Uh, Jordan Alvarez, Jacob DeGrom, Mike Clevenger, Spencer Torque, same one. I think yours is a little bit more off cut than, than Derek's left to right. Man, these things right here are terrible for left to right on those old school moments. He got the Wander. You get the Lewis Roberts, though. You get the number three guy. He got the number one. Nice Lewis Roberts there, though. Brendan Davis, we already seen him. De La Rosa first. Camo. Not bad. Jackson Kowar, we've already seen him there. Uh, Casas. Nick Matten, that's the guy we was talking about. And yeah, that'll come off. I thought that was a scratch, but all of this is a rub mark on it. But that's, I think he's considered the fourth or fifth best 
best one in first. So we'll put him up there. Nice little Nick Matten. That's the guy I was talking about in Sorry up in the minors or majors, Carson Tucker. So the right Garcia. The right. Uh -huh. All right, here we go. Cello pack number two. Believe me, I'm saving all these for you, Tom. You'll get them. Don't worry. I won't shit you out of those. All right. Two packs. I can't recall. I can't remember how many cards was in the blaster. Was it 10 cards in the blaster? Or was it 12 cards? I thought it was 12. And I think the Mojo box has 10 cards in the packs. Yeah, go figure that, right? The Mojo, the most expensive box, and it gives you 10 cards per pack. Whereas the blaster gives you 12 cards per pack. All right. Uh, looks like you got a pipeline here. I don't see any color. Can I get three silos? Brian, I have left two silos. Now, I've got a bunch of blasters, but I've got two silos left in that. Um, if you want some blasters to go on top of it, just let me know. Um, but I've got two silos left, Brian. I probably should have grabbed some more. Nolan Arnato, you let me know. Juan Soto, that's who the guy that I know you will always take another Juan Soto, no matter what it is. Aaron Judge, Mikey Skrimsky, Boba Shit, Trevor Bauer, and the pipeline is the Cubbies, Brendan Davis, single A, Abbott, double A, and Rivera's triple A. And we got a Mick Abel, pitcher first. Another nice one. Maybe I'm getting him confused with that one. One of these two. Are, maybe I think it's Mick Abel that's actually better. There's another Garrett Mitchell. Another Garrett Mitchell and Camo. Julio Rodriguez. We don't know nothing about him. Don't know whether he's going to be any good or not. <laughs> Pina. And Reyes first for Detroit. That's nice. Those sensors and number them. I will. Don't you worry. I'll get them sensors. At times. I find it hard to believe that you were at Walmart and walked out leaving a moment on the shelf taking my head. Yep. Well, like I said, I've got like, I've already put up like six or eight blasters. Um, I put up like three or four cellos. Um, I've got like, I don't know, probably 25 fat packs. And I don't know if I said blasters, but I got, uh, then I've got another, about 10 to 12 blasters that I'm going to rip or sell or whatever. I don't know. So I've, I've got a lot of omen, a lot. Uh, Reyes, first chrome. Not bad. All right, we'll do it, Brian. We'll do that, buddy. Jer Jeremy De La Rosa first as well. Bobby Miller. Robert Poussin. 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 All right, next pack. Maybe I should go get some more. I don't know. I'm sure I can reach out to some of my buddies and tell them to grab me some more cellos for sure. Um, don't know if that might just be a rookie card. Uh, Solaire. Uh, Sanchez, a rookie card. Alex Kirloff. Jose Garcia. Jimenez. Uh, Dylan Carlson, rookie of the year. Cardinal. Was it a big drop this week? Target said they sold 20K blasters last week online since they weren't stocking stores. I wouldn't doubt it, but if you think about it, 20K of blasters, if you spread that apart of all the targets, that doesn't sound like a lot, if you think about it. Because, I mean, you know, every state's probably got what? Shit, 100 probably targets or more. And if everyone got 10 blasters, you know, it's a lot of things. But, yes, this week is pretty big. It's got... Should come with like four Prism Megas of basketball, four Select Megas, uh, a bunch of Bowman, um, in cellos and blaster form. Not as many blasters, a lot of cellos though. No fat packs. Fat packs are gone. Um, Chronicles and hangers and blasters are coming out. Um, I'm trying to think. Pokemon, stuff like that. Oh, and score. A football with something that's coming out. There might be one or two selects that you'll see, but other than the mega of select and the mega prism, 
there's I think of one blaster, one or two, three or four blasters or something like that. And that's about it. Uh, but more, mainly Chronicles and Score and Bowman is the main ones. What's up, Rad Dad? How you doing, buddy? Uh, yeah, Dylan Carlson. Sorry, I got stuck on that question. Emerson Hancock. We'll put them up here. Emerson Hancock. Pitcher. Cody Welker is our camo. And we got a first of Eddie Diaz. Another first in camo. I'm never going to cover a Blaze Jordan. Uh, Jaron Duran. I like Jaron Duran. Clayton Beater. Toglia. Trammell. And Baez. So no numbers yet. No autos yet, but we still got two more cellos to go. Let's see. Let's see. Let me put you down here, Brian. You said you wanted number three. Is going to... Brian, you'll be up next, by the way. Uh, Brian McConnell. You wanted two cellos and plus one blaster. And shipping. Okay. Got you down, Brian. Glad you reminded me. Jared Duran. I like Jared Duran. He's from like a, I think he's a good, good up and comer. Was his first last year, I think it was. <coughs> I got a lot of, I think I got like a few of his number cards that I just picked up on eBay to kind of backfill. I think that he's going to be pretty good. We'll see. All right. Alex Kirloff again. Rookie card. Jose Garcia. Seemed like he's the same pack here. Andrew Jimenez. Oh, we didn't get him. Dylan Carlson rookie. That's our first Dylan Carlson rookie of tonight. Miggy and Casey Mize. And still a little OC left to right. They just cannot get the printing press to straighten out with these old school Bowmans. Beautiful cards, but always a little OC left right. Uh, Francisco Alvarez. And we got a first here. Jeremy De La Rosa. Getting a lot of his first cards, it seems like. Uh, Figuero. Jake Vogel. First Chrome. And Tyler Freeman. Tyler Freeman Chrome. Delquist. Mackenzie Gore. Oh, we got a number card here. The only bad thing about it is, it looks like it's going to be a pitcher. I see his hand up there in the air. We'll find out if it's going to be a first. Looks like it's a prospect. Oh, man. Your luck. Look at that. Look at the bad luck you got. Tom, it's a Dern Mariners. Golly. Yes, got plenty of blasters of Bowman, Rad Dad. Plenty of it. Uh, $18 a pop. Yep. But it's a Mariners. Well, you know, yep. Ooh, look at that ugly face, too. Man. It is Logan Gilbert out of two ninety nine. dollars 99 I think this is the first pink that I've actually got out. Maybe I'm wrong, but nine, this is 99 out of 299 99 out of 299. Logan Gilbert. 14th overall in 2018. And the typical Bowman. Look at the left to right. It's always going to be on the number cards, parallels, the good cards. You know, seem like that's the only ones that they're able to constantly miscut on with any frequency or scratch up or ding or whatever, it seems like it's always going to be on the good cards, right? But you did get a number. So we, we went through one, two, three, four, five, five and a half and got a number card. Cellos. So I don't know. I, I guess that's kind of like a blaster. I don't know. Something like that. Set that Gilbert aside for Shalini. All right. To Shalini from Tom. Um, look at that beautiful handwriting, too, that you said. Look at that. Beautiful handwriting. Mm -hmm. All right, set that to the side as well. All right, here we go. Didn't like this to hew this same height as killing it. I'm at my bad. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Max Kepler. The Labor Day. Blake Snell, Hugh Darvish, your Scooball rookie card, Clark Schmidt, and we got a pipeline here of the Brewers, Bryce Drang, Feliciano, 
and Corey Ray. Ray, never heard of Corey Ray. Have not heard of Corey Ray. I'm sure Tom has. I mean uh, James. Nolan Jones. We got a first here. There we go. That's what you're after, right there. That's what we're after. And this is actually centered perfectly, huh? But that's a nice camo of Austin Martin. I guess that would be considered just almost as good as Chrome, maybe. Due to the rarity of it. Uh, the blasters are 35 rad that. Look in the comments if you want anything else other than Bowman. I've got a bunch of different products down there depending on what you want. But it's a nice little Austin Martin right there in camo. Bryce Terrain in camo as well. Both made their debut this year. Magic freaking hands. <laughs> uh, but yeah, everything's in the description down below. If you want something, just let me know. CJ Chatham, I've got some high-end stuff down there. And I've got some you know normal stuff as well. We can rip into some Prism Megas if you want to. I don't care. Uh, but they're pretty expensive. Kate Cavalli. Tyler Solderstrom, not bad there. Clayton Beater and Isaiah Green. Isn't it always the same? Correlation. All right, so we got one more cello here for Tom. One more cello. Austin Martin in camo. Let me get these autographed and send these to Tom. These little inserts here. All right, here we go. Pack number one. In the last blaster and a minute there, I thought I seen some purple but I didn't Anthony Rendon is just the way the chrome gloss kind of does it Ryan Mattcastle first time we've seen him tonight as far as base rookie card Abe Marque Otan there's a Aaron Judge and of course Aaron Judge is gonna be perfectly centered right because it's not a rookie card <laughs> Austin Hendricks, 86 for the Reds. The Reds. Taylor Trammell, Camo, a first Eddie Diaz, and Riley Green. Riley Green. Riley Green. Austin Hendricks, again in Chrome. Nick Allen, and a first of Gabriel Arias. We'll put him over there. Baez and Shea Langoliers. Shay Langoliers. They're saying, thinking about actually calling him up, possibly. Might be one of the guys. You think they missed Keith's rookies on purpose? Yeah, just to piss us off, I think, more than anything, Tom. Probably so. But, hey, man, this is going to be a good card here, probably. Let's cut this and all the shit. Let's all center it and stuff. we got to control the pop, you know? <laughs> they're, they're, in, they're in for us, Tom. Josh Bell, Mookie Betts, Alex Bregman. Jose Abreu, Tatis, there's your guy that you'd like to have. That's the first one I think I've seen him <coughs> in Rookie of the Year favorites. Wouldn't even think he'd be considered a favorite, but there you go. <laughs> Luis Garcia, put him over the Brewers, right? Marco Luciano, I like Marco Luciano. Another Garrett Mitchell. Garrett Mitchell and Camo must be very popular, I think. Uh, I missed something here. I love CJ Chatham cards. CJ Chatham. Uh, Jose Tina, first. Daniel, oh, what am I doing? He's a first, so he gets, he gets, he gets shelved. He gets shelved. Daniel Espinosa, another Garrett Mitchell. This must be a Garrett Mitchell night. And there he is in Chrome. Chrome Garrett Mitchell. Marco Luciano, Robert Poussin, and Taylor Trammell. So, we got two out of the five. They were both paper, but one of them was a good parallel right there. Let's go ahead and, let's go ahead and sleeve up. I usually do the Jordans in the Sublimus. So I just forgot to do Derek's, but I'll get his in a second as well. I'm going to get off the stream. But yeah. we got a bunch of other good Chrome cards, first cards, camo cards, rookie cards, so forth and so on. Nice little stack right there. So out of seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, out of seven, we have gotten one number card. No autos yet. Bunch of first. Haven't hit the chrome in first that we're after out of the top third, but we did get the parallel. But Dylan 
Carson MDS, Bill Carson again. Got a bunch of firsts, just not the people that we wanted other than that. Austin Martin, which was pretty cool. Austin Hedrick, Nick Bell, he might be pretty good. Lewis Roberts is a nice one there. Marciano, Mount Castle, Casey Mize, Emerson Aguilar Sanchez, Nick Matten there, and then Nate Pearson. I love that blue, that blue on blue. I, like, I love the color scheme they did. Almost like feels like opening the HGA thing whenever you get that. Let me write this down, Tom. Your stack. I set it off to the side. If you want something else, just let me know, Bo, and we'll rip it and put it in your stack as well. All right. Tom stack. Tom stack goes to the side. All right. I'll take a blaster of Bowman. All right. So we got Rad and Dad. He'll put you in fourth. Rad and Dad. One Bowman blaster. All right. I got you down next, uh, Rad, and I've got Brian next. You're welcome, Tom. You're welcome, buddy. Um, let me see if I've missed anybody else. I said anything else. The side for Shalani. I got the Shalani up to the side. Okay. All right. Okay. So, unfortunate enough, you don't get to pick, Brian. You get the last two cellos. I guess I have to go out and get some more cellos. And you wanted a blaster, but you will get to pick the blaster. Let me put a couple... Put a few blasters up here. You decide which ones you want, and then we'll kind of go from that. How about that? All right. One and two. We'll get you a nice good pick of three here. All right. There we go. Another one. There you go. One, two, or three. Pick your poison. Pick your poison. Take your poison, Brian. One, two, or three. One, two, three. <clears throat> one. All right. First one up. We'll set that right there off to the corner. Put these off to the side. Let's get into some cellos because I'm kind of curious to see if we can get anything else in the cellos. So this is going to be a total of seven, eight, nine cellos. I thought I had more than that. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I guess I just had nine. I guess I put up more than I thought I did. Yeah, I put up about five for me to rip. I think I've already opened one. So I'll have to get some more cellos, I guess. Do you like the cellos better, or do you think the hit rate's better in the blasters? I don't know. We'll open up these last two. We'll, find, we'll figure it out, right? Here we go. First one, Brian. First one. We'll get a decent comparison because we'll, we'll open up a blaster right behind it. We still got fat packs too. I don't know if I put that in the chat. Did I put fat packs in Bowman as well? Okay, yeah, I did. Okay. Um, start off with a Mike Trout. I'll put your blaster right there behind. All right, Mike Trout always gets on the head. Luis Garcia, Cody B, Josh Donaldson, Aaron Nola. There's a Christian Pache and a well, maybe if he was hitting real good, it probably would have been off-center. But <laughs> it's not hitting real good, but it's still a nice Christian Pache rookie card. Bowman throwback. Uh, Bryson Stott, number 92. And our camo is going to be Adley Rushman. It's a nice little camo right there. We'll put Adley up there. Nick York and Cody Wilker. So we get two more in the next pack. There's a Jeter Downs Chrome and a first of Severino. We haven't seen him yet. That's a nice chrome second baseman. Vidal, Luis Garcia, and Simeon Woods Richardson for the first pack. Got a few out there. Still looking for some firsts. Get the next pack in. Got an Anthony Santander. Hmm. I think that's just a rookie card. All these the Rick Yard, you see it, the, the, the color throws you off like, oh, it's a parallel or something like that. But, oh, well. Anthony Santander, Bobby Dahlback rookie card, gets on the front line right there. Christian Pache, we're going to put him over here with the other Pache. Kibbert Ruiz, 
Louis Patino and a Rookie of the Year, Nick Madrigal. Have not seen that one yet. Didn't even know he was Rookie of the Year favorite, but there he is, Nick Madrigal. And a futurist, Robert Hassel. Robert Hassel. And a Diaz. And a first of Mick Abel. All right. First Mick Abel in camo. Put him over here. Trevor Larnack, Nick Lodolo, Nick Matten. So we got a, a Nick and a Mick, both for the Phillies. And Kevin Alcantara first as well. We'll put him over here. And George Kirby. All right. Cello, one down. Second Cello. So far, no autos out of the Cello out of nine, but we have gotten one numbered card out of 299. Let's see if this last one get us one more. If not, we'll make up. Hopefully, we'll make up for it in the last one. Start off with a rookie card of Daryl Carlson. Much more Carlson here. Uh, Miguel Cabrera. Miggy. Max Kepler. Labor Day. Tyler. Excuse me. Blake Snell. <laughs> Haven't got him yet and pulled two of them back to back. The correlation is just so awesome. Maybe I should have went front to back on some of these blasters or some of these things versus just grabbing them all around right the line there. Key Brian Hayes is nice. Rookie card, and he's number 42. Key Brian Hayes. I think he's injured now, though, right? Look at there. That's a nice one. A Blaze Jordan in camo. That's sweet. Blaze Jordan in camo. That's a sweet one. Uh, Alex Thomas. Byron Laura is kind of nice there, too. Christopher Morell. Another first. <laughs> Nick Matten. <laughs> We're getting him tonight. That's his chrome. Maybe he turns out in some. We got another first right behind it, and it's Gabriel Arias. And Robert Poussin. And Taylor Trammell. Those are not a bad little pack right there. Nice Blaze Jordan camo. All right. Final pack of Cello out of. And let's see what we got. Mm, don't see any numbers unless we got a sneaky auto out of paper. Who knows about that? So there. Uh, we got a Jesus Sanchez. Alex Kirloff. Jose Garcia, Andre Jimenez. We got a pipeline here of the New York Yankees pipeline. Alvarez, Stefan, and Peraza. I think it is. Haven't heard of none of those, though. That is a nice Jason Dominguez, futurist. That's a nice one. And Chrome. Let's set that over here. There's another Wander Franco in camo. That looks kind of sweet. We're definitely going to put that up there. Reed Edmer, possible good one there. Nick Gonzalez, Emerson Hancock and Chrome, uh, Marco Luciano, Jonathan India, and Bobby Miller. So one number card out of nine cellos. If you think of it, it's almost like a, a fat pack of a cello. It's a little bit more than a fat pack. We'll get into this blaster, see if we can get a little bit more. I like that. I, I, are you seeing that? Yeah, I like that thing too. It looks pretty sweet. The Blaze Jordan. That guy almost looks like, he looks like a real, real deal ball player, you know? He looks like he's hardcore getting down there after the ball. All right, let's see what we got for this blaster here you picked. Good luck, Brian. No cam no more camos. We're just going for some nice chromes or maybe an auto or number card. Who knows? All right, now see, these have 12 cards in it per pack. And so it's basically almost like getting two cellos or three cellos. One, two, three cellos. So correlation is about the same as far as chromes. You just basically you get a little bit less filler. You get a few. Uh, you get a few camos for your fillers basically. But you get more packs. I think you get more cards in the blaster versus a cello if you bought three cellos. So definitely will be cheaper buying the blaster than it would be the cellos, but. Here we go. 
Dang. 431? Holy crap. I think that's going to be Key Brian Hayes, I think, right there. We're going to find out and see. All right. Francisco Lindor. J.D. Martinez. Austin Hayes. Evan White. Rookie card goes up there. Travaris, Jazz Chisholm, and nope, Jake Cronsworth. It was a Jake. Jake Cronsworth. And George Kirby, which I think that's the second George Kirby we got a Chrome tonight. Simeon Woods Richardson. I always pull a lot of him in Chrome for some reason. Zach Veen is not bad. We'll put him up there. CJ Chatham and Jordan Bella Zobic. <coughs> First pass. <coughs> So, Jesus Sanchez batting 431. That's killer. He needs to be moved up, man. I don't see any color. But we do get a Casey Mize. Rookie card. Devin Garcia. Another Drake Cronesworth. Put him over here. Louis Camposano. Acuna. I always get front row. Shane Bieber. And we got a pipeline here. This is going to be a Marlins, I think, pipeline. Yes. J.J. Blade. I didn't think in single A, Cabrera in double, and Tommy in triple. Let's put it up there as well. Ronnie Mauricio. Huh. First time ever I've seen a card that was upside down in chrome. Hmm. Nothing special about it. Just kind of weird, I guess. Two Mets, back to back, but then this is upside down. Ismail first. Matthew Thompson and D.L. Hall. That was kind of weird there. Never seen them turn upside down before. Hmm. I thought there was going to be something special there for a minute, but oh well. All right. Pack number three. This will be the halfway point of the blaster. Don't see any color yet. Christian Yelich. Sean Murphy. Kyle Lewis. Max Scherzer. Chris Bryant, Santander, Bobby Dahlback, Ricky Card, Bobby Witt Jr. and Chrome, Prospect, that's a nice one. We'll set that up there. Matt Manning, Asa Lacey, Andrew Vaughn, Nick York. Not a bad pack. We'll see some first. We need some first in Chrome. First in Chrome. Christian Pache, Ricky Card. I don't think so. Uh, Christian Pache, Ricard. Okay, here we go. Gilbert Ruiz, Louis Patino, Mike Trout again. Another Mike Trout. Louis Callis, uh, Castellano, Cody B, Jordan Balavot, Balazovic. Well, there we go. Number 91 for the Twins. And Hunter Green. I think it's who old uh, Michael P. likes. Good old Hunter Green right there. And look at there, it's another one. Look at this, turned upside down. This is a first, though. It is Jose Salas, first, upside down. That's weird. Nick Matten, all that stuff that we opened, and it's the first time ever seeing that. And Oswald Perez, Nick Matten. It's a Phillies night for firsts. Two more packs to go in your blaster. Still looking for an auto or a numbered card. I think so. Josh Donaldson, Aaron Nola, Joey Gallo, Vladdy, Lou Bob. I haven't seen Lou Bob in a while. Freddie Freeman, a rookie card of Casey Mize. And it's not as bad as the others. Just a little OC left to right. Austin Wells. Good prospect there. Elliot Ramos. Ryan Julio. Espinosa. Last pack of the blaster here. Brian. Let's see what we can get. Last pack of the blaster. Tanner Houck starts it off. A rookie card. Sam Huff rookie. Dalton Varsho rookie. All these miscellaneous rookies. And Brady Singer. Alex Bombs, our first pull of him tonight. We'll put him up there. Nolan Arnano. Juan Soto. I guess we'll put him up here. I don't know. Nick Gonzalez. Not bad. And 
Huh. Uh, De La Rosa first. I swear I don't remember any of them being turned up like that. Ramirez first. Diaz first. And Garrett Mitchell. Another Garrett Mitchell tonight. So we got a bunch of firsts right there. Um, but we did hit one Jordan Blaze, or Blaze Jordan. I don't know why I keep saying Jordan Blaze. Blaze Jordan camo. We did get some bunch of firsts and rookies out of your stack as well. We'll bust them right quick, Brian. If you want anything else, let me know. Definitely got this Blaze Jordan right here in this Ryan Mount Castle. Let me go ahead and, while I'm thinking about it, let's go ahead and get at least one. Let's go ahead and get the top three sleeved up at the beginning versus later, even though they're just going to stack. But got a bunch of good little cards here. We'll just bust through them right quick. There's the JD. I like that. Key Brian Hayes looks pretty sweet as well. Nick Ape was a camo there. Hunter Green. Another Trout. Rookies, 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 rookies. Wander is nice. Um, Christian Pache again. There's another Pache like that. Cronesworth. Two of these Nick Madrigals back to back. Another Casey Mize there. Bobby Witt and Chrome is nice. Matten, Dylan Carlson, Robert Hassel, Torino, Diaz. Just like I said, just a bunch of firsts that you get. You just never know which ones are going to turn in and develop into one. There's always hype around a few of them. You just don't know which ones is going to develop. So there's a lot of people still chasing back in the the 2016 draft or 2017 draft cards that just now come out that we never knew about. So not a bad rip. Not a bad. Let me put your name on this, Brian. Brian McConnell. And I'll set you to the side as well, buddy. You got a nice little stack. If you want anything else, let me know in chat. I'm going to set this off to the side and hit up, start going to the next one, which is going to be Rad and Dad. Rad and Dad. I'm going to put these same two blasters up there that we had before. And I'm going to add one more to it. You tell me which one you want. All right. One, two, or three. One, two, or three, Rad and Dad. He left over one and two. He didn't pick one and two. Brian did, and I added three. So you tell me which one you want there, Rad. Number two, going for the middle. Going for the middle. All right. Let's see what the middle proves. See if the middle was a lucky blaster. And we'll find out, Rad and Dad. If anybody didn't get their packages that I sent off, let me know. Probably by, like, say, Saturday. You can always email me or something. If you just now lift the chat. I need to figure out something I want to do for the giveaway. Because I've got 500 subscribers now. And I've been meaning to do that. Ooh, look at all this. Now we got Bowman dust. Um, but I need to figure out something I'm going to do with that. Don't know if I want. might just do a baseball, basketball, and a football. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe like a blaster of each. We'll see. All right. First pack. Good luck. Okay, you did get your package today. All right, cool. Some of the bigger packages. Ooh. You might have picked the right one. I don't know if that's an atomic or what. Let's just peek at it a little bit. That's a stripper sparkle one right there. We're going to have to save the stripper sparkle. Sorry. Brad. What's up, Farm League? How you doing, buddy? Go to the next one. Okay. Uh, Charlie Blackman, Brian Anderson, Bryce Harper, Yachty, Francisco Lindor, J.D. Martinez, and a chrome of Devin Garcia. He barely made the cut. He's at 97. We'll put him up there. Francisco Alvarez and Jose Salas. First chrome. He goes up there. Ismail 
first. He's going to go up there as well. I'll put the first over to the right. Let's do it like that. There's Jordan again. Michael Matthew Montgomery. All right, so we're going to set this stack here. But what all we went through over here, so we know to open that up. Only Austin Hayes. Evan White, rookie card. Put him up there. Traveris, Jazz Chisholm, Casey Mize, Devin Garcia again. And look at that. That's the first one I've seen of him, and he's upside down. Look at that. He said Bo Jackson ain't got nothing on him. He's carrying both bats. He'll bat with two in the batter's box. And look at that bling around his neck. Like a Mr. T startup kit or something like that, it looks like. But that's the first one I've seen of that in Wander Franco. Jordan Walker, Chrome, Bone Ailer Chrome, Asa Lacey, D.L. Hall, and Andrew Vaughn. We'll put Andrew Vaughn up top. Great photo. It is a pretty cool photo. I do like that photo. It looks pretty sweet. Paul here too. Hey, what's going on with the mayor? How you doing, buddy? Just ripping some Bowman. I put all, all kind of products, and every time I put it out there, everybody just says, I just want Bowman. Just give me Bowman. We just want to rip Bowman. I'm like, all right, whatever. We'll rip Bowman. I'll have to go get some more, I guess. Jay Cronsworth, rookie card. That goes up here somewhere. Camposano, Acuna. He goes right. Man, he should go over right in the center. Shane Heber, Christian Yelich, uh, Sean Murphy, Kyle Lewis, and our chrome is Brendan Davis. Right when Paul C. comes in, we start pulling some cubbies. And Della Rosa is our first chrome. Matten first, as always. We're getting him tonight for sure. Nick York and Diaz. Diaz. Love the Bowman. You get to see the Wander Franco. Three out of five Bowman auto for sale for 200. Yeah, I've seen that. Yep. I've seen that. So let's see. A house or a ball card? House or a ball card? Mm. That's a close call. It's close. Close. I mean, think about it. A card. And I know people can go crazy, but I don't give a crap of how rare it is. A card. Paper. Paper. 200,000. I know we all get involved in the good card, the good chrome, or the rare autos and stuff like that. But man. Max Scherzer. Chris Bryant. Santander. I'll say that. And if I get something like that, I'm going to put it out there for sale immediately. I'm like, man, I can't hold on to something like that. Bobby Tallback rookie card's a nice one. We'll put it up there. We'll put it up there. Uh, Christian Pache, Hall of Famer. Gibber Ruiz, CJ Abrams. Somebody, was it Rad and Dad or was it Brian that loves the Padres? I can't remember. The nice CJ Abrams right there. Tristan Casa, Alex Thomas, or Alec, Alec Thomas, uh, Ryan. Oswald, Julio. Don't forget, we still got to open that pack. You got a little bit of something special in that one. I think it. I think that Chrome, that Stripper Sparkle, was out of two ninety nine. I think, but I could be wrong. I think that's what it was. All right, Louis Patino, Mike Trout, and Mike Trout, and Mike Trout right there. Yes, there for Carhart. Uh -huh. Jim Davis hit a home run the last two nights for the South Bend Cubs. He is starting a high A because he got a hit in the face at the end of spring training. He is a stud. Darn. Uh, Castellano, Cody B, Josh Donaldson, Nola, and Casey Myers. He was number eight. Number eight in the Bowman scouting. Uh, Nick, Josh Young, a first of Ramirez, Espinoza, and Eddie Diaz. So we didn't get one of the top three. But we still got this last pack to go that's got something a little special in there. A little bit of chrome going in there. As you can see it, let's switch it around like that. And we'll start off with a Zach Veen right there. Tyler Freeman. CJ Chatham. Last pack, Jose Abreu. Fernando Tatis. Aaron 
Rendon Ryan. Mount Castle's nice. We'll put him up here. Old Mount Castle. Christian Javier. Uh, Marquez. Shohei. A chrome of Josh, uh, Johia Gray. And our stripper sparkle is upside down. And it's a brewer. It's a brewer. Where's James Palmer at? Look at there. We've seen this guy before. I know who that is. That's old Garrett Mitchell. Nice Garrett Mitchell right there at a 299. 147 out of 299. Good prospect for the Brewers. Probably one of the, what is he, the best prospect in the organization, James? Nice Garrett Mitchell right there. Picking cards over. Uh, best part of picking cards over house. The ex wife probably wouldn't fight over the cards. <laughs> yeah, that, that, is, that is true there, Barry. That is true. Look at that. Nice Garrett Mitchell. Beautiful card right there, Rad and Dad. Nice. Nice. Garrett Mitchell. Let James Palmer drool over that a little bit, right? I have noticed these number cards seem like they're a little bit thicker, too, for some reason. But nice, Garrett Mitchell. Beautiful. All right. I love this Wander Franco. That's a sweet looking Wander Franco. It reminds me so much of that Bono's where they say you got a shirt off and a bite behind his head. Kind of emulation of that a little bit. Sweet looking card. I'm hoping I get to pull one of those because they look pretty sweet. Eddie Diaz, that would look nice and sleek, uh, nice in a graded card, wouldn't it? Bobby Dahlback, Nick Matten. Cronensworth Vaughn, Myas, Mountcastle, Pache, De La Rosa first, Evan White. Uh, Casey Ma, CJ, Acuna, Garcia, Wander, Ramirez, Trout, and Mina. So, not a bad little blaster there. Got you numbered out of that, too. Maybe number middle was correct. I think that maybe Brian just picked wrong. Who knows? All right. So, Rad and Dad, I got you. Anything else? Uh, what I've noticed about Bowman this year is the center is generally not good. Yes, especially in the throwback Bowman. It's not very good for sure. Not very good. So, um, anybody else want anything else before I maybe rip one more pack for myself or something? I'm still waiting on some of my stuff to come in a little bit. I pulled a Bowman, uh, Bowman Scout Top 100 Ian Anderson and thought it. I will send it to fuck with it. I know it's a huge cash in the car. Hey, <laughs> I know I've shown this before, but I keep this Jalen Hurts. Look at this thing. This thing is scratched all the shit. This thing come this way. It looks like somebody dragged it across the pavement. And I keep on keeping it here to remind me every time I pull a card and I bitch about a corner or a off centering a little bit, I pull this and remember, well, it could be worse. <laughs> A silver uh, patch, Jalen Hurts, this drug across the cement. And that's how it comes in the pack. So I keep that right over here, right next to me. So every time I pull something, I notice that, hey, it can't be that bad. You know what I mean? Because that thing right there is like, if I turn that in and grade it, I'll be lucky if I get a 0.5 grade on that thing. That's terrible. But I'm trying to get that card and get that thing sent off and returned and somebody send me another card, I'd probably spend probably 25 hours in calling and, and leg work and everything, trying to get that thing returned and thing. I'm like, screw it. I'm not dealing with these crackheads. I said, I'll just keep the freaking card. Like it was used as a shim under a printer before getting backed up. Yeah. Probably wouldn't doubt it. Yeah. Either that or they laid like concrete with it or, or, or something like that. And they used it like a spatula and started dragging it like right there. Or they used something to started rubbing across it. You know? Yeah. One of those two. So, but yeah, I keep that right on my computer to remind me, hey, it could be worse, right? <laughs> What's up, Shalani? If nobody else has got anything else, I'm going to find me something to rip. Uh, let me see here. What do I want to rip? What haven't I ripped? Ooh. I know what I could rip. 
Um, hmm. Yeah. I know everybody loves some baseball. We've opened up a lot of Bowman, so it really is not good for me to go ahead and um, um, open more Bowman because everybody's seen a bunch of Bowman. Let's open this bad boy up. What do you say? I've been wanting to open this up for a while. Unless somebody else has got something else they want that I'll be more than happy to part with, um, I'm going to go ahead and open this bad boy. And then saving this for about a week and a half, two weeks. And I'm curious to see what this mega box will carry because this is actually the last mega that I got out of Target. I think it's actually, I've had it for two weeks now because this has got the purple prism die cuts in this. Um, right before, this is the last week they closed down. This was the last product I got from um target so i open it up i do have a one of these over in uh walmart version but only one in target so i'm definitely going to open that up for myself the gospel according to paul thou shalt never tire of bone <laughs> all right let's see what we got that's it. A bunch of packs, empty fillers in there, whatever. We're looking for the, says we got 10 mega exclusive purple prism die cuts. Purple prism die cuts. And this is a 2020. I like the class of 2020. Beautiful product in 2020. That's a nice one to start with. And that is a concourse of T. Higgins. That's a nice one there. Ooh, these purples do look sweet looking. Kind of wish it was a different card. It's got a nice good crack right there in the center of it. So that kind of adds the, the effect to it a little bit. So that's awesome. But that's a Brandon Cook. Tom Brady can never go wrong grabbing a Tom Brady, right? And Tyron. Yeah. So got a T. Higgins out of it. And we got a cracked up purple. We get in the next pack, man. Whoa, it could always be worse. Damn, about missed the name on that one, didn't we? Holy shit! Man, about missed the whole name on it. So off center, top to bottom on that. That'll get a PSA three. Now, this is pretty cool. Wish it was a better player, but Josh Uchi, that is a field level purple on that. Prism die cut. Wish it was somebody other than Josh Uchi, but still a sweet looking card. A Joe Namath and oh my gosh, another James Morgan. And who was a premier? Yeah, premier level. Premier level rookie of James Morgan. Eh. Didn't get another James Morgan yet. Yeah, that was a concourse. But man. All right, we don't need no more James Morgans. Come on, let's give me some of the good quarterbacks. Hell, who knows? He might be one that's going to turn out to be, you know, awesome. But another off-center card, top to bottom. Derrick Henry barely caught his name at the bottom. We got a chrome in this one. That's a nice one. Julio. Got to like a Julio. Oddball, what's up, Oddball? How you doing, one cent? What's going on, Bob? You doing all right? I thought you was leaving. Are you traveling or something like that? Or hadn't left quite yet. There's a nice Julio. But Lamar, P. Ryan, P. Ryan, silver. And this is Premier as well. Nice Premier prism. And we got a field level of Tyler Johnson for the Buccaneers. Tyler Johnson. Two pretty good cards. Nothing great. Nothing great. Let's go to the next pack. We'll just put this half cut Derrick Henry off to the side. All right, how about a Chase Claypool auto? That will be sweet. That will be sweet. 
Jake Luton. Man, the same guy, purple. And this is Tyron. Certified. No, that's not bad. Jalen Rager. Eh, I thought it was Jalen Hurts, uh, but it's Jalen Rager. Uh, and we got a Rob Gronk. Have you seen Rob Gronkowski's girlfriend? Mm -mm -mm. Man. This right here is a, is a club level. Club level. All right, next pack. Nothing like a cabin with Wi-Fi. Ooh, there you go. Uchi and his brother tries to overthrow the government. It would be a, a Uchi Uchi Coop. <laughs> Uchi Uchi Coop. Uh, uh, Jerry Judy. Nice little rookie card there. Ooh, I think we got a backwards card here, possibly. Or a numbered card. A Jalen Rager. And that is purple. And we've got a... Travis Kelsey Field. We gotta get in this. Hold on. Let's go to this Jalen Rager. This is Premier. It's not a bad rookie card there for the Eagles. But this is sweet. This has got to be numbered. Travis Kelsey Field level. Man, it's not numbered. Are you kidding me? That white is hard to pull. A die cut field level. Travis Kelsey. You gotta love Travis Kelsey. What a baller! What a baller! And we got a Raquan Davis for the Dolphins rookie card, and this is club level off defensive tackle. So, so <laughs> gotta love modern set one cents. Definitely new to here. Yep. All right, next pack: Adam Thielen and Zeke Elliott. That looks sweet. Man, that does look sweet, though. All that die cut in that bad boy. All these die cuts go over here. Uh, Devin Hester and Isaiah Coulter. So we're missing our darn quarterbacks. I love that Travis Kelsey, though. We've got four packs to go. Let's see what I can get with me. A Sheep's DC Pale Ale called Fresh Coast. Got some ham fish today. Talking to the wife shopping tomorrow in the flea market. I was going to rain. Yep. Flea markets. Hey, you might find some good deals at the flea market. Van Jefferson finally getting some centering stuff there. Now, that's a nice one. Everybody loves a Tom Brady die cut. Purple. Sweet looking card there. Drew Brees right behind it. His last card of the years. And another Jerry Judy. You got two Jerry Judys. That right there is the premier level. And we got the concourse. Three more packs. Fresh coat sounds real nice. Real nice. Real nice. Troy Palomalo. We got a chrome in here too. Looks like, or a silver, I should say. Adam Thielen. Purple on purple. And our silver is Julio. Missing, missing our quarterbacks in silver. And Clyde Edwards Hilaire, I'll take that. I'll take a Clyde Edwards Hilaire club level. It's actually not too bad centering. These right here are terrible, terrible for centering. But that Clyde is actually pretty good at centering there. All right, two more packs. We'll see if anybody else wants to open up any more. Another Tyron, Tyler Johnson. And Dalton Keene. Larry Fitz, we're going up and down. Feels like we're doing Don, uh, feel like we're doing upper deck here. And Drew Brees, so no notable rookies out of that at all, kind of deal. Just a couple, couple here and there. Last pack, I do like that white though. Ooh, I think I've seen a Charger at the back. I'm hoping it's who we want, Herbert. We ain't got none of the top quarterbacks out of this whole mega box. AJ Brown. Uh, he's seen some Wisconsin beer sometimes. Fresh. They know how to do beer in the cheesy state for sure. <laughs> AJ Brown. And another Tom Brady. That's, look at that. Two of the same cards. I'm glad they get this correlation right. And we got another white one right behind it. Oh, man. A big Ben. White and a Van Jefferson rookie card. 
I was hoping that that was a charger. I thought it was a charger, but it wasn't. But this big bin is a premier level white. So I'm sure somebody would like that card. I'll find somebody for that one. So I don't know. Hit or miss product, I guess. Usually select is pretty good. Didn't hit anything great out of that. None of the big quarterbacks or anything that I wanted, but hey, is what it is. Got some decent cards out of it. Clyde Edwards was probably our best rookie pull other than Jerry Judy. Um, so, not too bad. Got some decent cards there. Jerry Judy. T. Higgins was going, I like it. Travis Kelsey, and I like his Tom Brady. He's got two of them. That's kind of sweet. Jalen Hurts, Tyler Johnson, Uchi, Adam Thielen, Elliot Rager, and Julio. So, not a bad. Probably give it about a C plus, B minus blaster, something like that, or um, not blaster, but mega. So, just more cards to sort. More cards to sort for sure. Yeah, wild. I got two, two out of one freaking thing. So, all right, all right. I've opened my stuff tonight. Does anybody else want anything else before I sign off, so I can sort these cards and get them organized? I want to thank anybody that bought in for sure. I'll grab some more cellos or tell the guys to pick me up some more cellos. Still got plenty of blasters and fat packs. A Bowman. Uh, do you have Bowman fat packs? Yes. Check in my comments below, uh, Paul. Um, but yes, I have many several fat packs. Uh, they are, I've got blasters and fat packs of Bowman. The blasters are 35. The fat packs are 15, Paul. You tell me what you want. I'll grab it. That's what you want to do. What's up, T-Bone? How you doing, buddy? T-Bonage. Hey, scroll down in the comments, T-Bone. Look at the very last blaster that I got. If you're interested, I got one of them. That's the only one that I got. I'll take three. Sending you the money. All right. Will do. I'm going to grab a few here. Out of the stack. You tell me what one you want. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Let you pick from. Let's see right and check one. See if calling a game for the radio tonight. Oh, there you go. We'll start it off like that, Paul C. I've got six of them out here. One, two, three, four, five, six. You tell me which numbers you want. Wayne is very good at communications in English. I think that's his major. So if you need anybody to write you a resume or anything like that or, or do a commentary, then there you go. Wayne's your guy. I majored in Redneckian. I'm pretty good at that. So if you need me to translate in Redneckian, I can do that for you. You want the top three, Paul? All right. I'll put the bottom three away. One, two, three. I, oh, I got Chronicles, and I've also got, if you look down, scroll down a little further there, Wayne. Look at the very, very bottom. Very, very bottom. There's only one in stock, if you see it. But I do have Crockles Blasters. I'll put them at a pretty decent price, too. I'll see if you can put them in a break or whatever. Chronicles is a real fun rip. All right, Paul C., you've got three packs here. Let's see what we got. UFC uh, T-Bone. It's at the very, very bottom. You only got one. I found that. All right. Bunch of chrome. 
Don't see any color, though. But an Ian Anderson is a good start. Nick Madrigal. Garrett. Jose Altuve. Pistol Pete. Manny Machado. Luis Garcia. Not bad. A pipeline for the Braves. Shea Langoliers. Brian Shoemake and Drew Waters. And it actually probably is the best three in our pipeline right there for sure. Um, he needs to step it up. I think Drew Waters and Shea Langelier is better than Brandon Shoemake, even though Brandon Shoemake makes the most money out of all three of them, probably combined. Joey Bart, Rookie of the Year, is a nice one right there. Nice Joey Bart. Nolan Gorman. Shea Langoliers, there he is, catcher. With all our catcher injuries, I can't believe they haven't pull, pulled him up yet. Reed Etmer. Bryce Terrain. Robert Hassel. Montero. Rutledge. Larnack. Lodolo. And Jeter Dan. So, we got a couple there. Wasn't probably the best one there. A lot of chrome just not what we was after. Is, is well above average. Langley is well above average. I think he is. I mean, um, but Contreras, that's our, I think he was our third catcher on our starting now. That's starting now because we're down two catchers in a row. Um, he ain't doing too bad. I don't know about this one, Paul. I think that's, I think those are two rookie cards in there, Chrome. Drew the best of the three. I think he is, but we have so many outfielders already. Um, but he should be called up just because we need him in there to fill now. What's his face? It got hurt. Pete Alonzo, Manny Machado, another Luis Garcia. So we're going to have this kind of, there's a 6 dose Sanchez. We didn't get him last time. Thought there was going to be a repeat pack here. Jordan Alvarez, Jacob DeGrom, Mike Clevenger, and our rookie card is Sixto Sanchez. <laughs> That, that looks like almost, that's almost cropped, doesn't it? That don't even look like him. It looks like a like somebody like made him in 3D or something. I don't know. It looks kind of weird looking his face. I don't know. And then we got a Reed Detmers. Futurist. Gilbert. Yeah, he's doing a lot better than I thought he would. Uh, Cabrera. Feliciano, Corbin Carroll, Cody Welker, Mick Abel, first, Kristen Robinson, Matthew Levator, a first of Jake Vogel, and Little Kid Armstrong. <laughs> um, Contreras, yeah, I thought he wasn't going to do nothing. He's, I mean, he ain't doing great. He's doing okay. Um, was he batting? Probably like... 260 ish, something like that, I think. I mean, that ain't bad for a catcher, you know what I mean? I and mean, what do you really expect out of a catcher? You know, I think there's so many Buster Posies out there, right? Uh, thing here. All right, pack number three, Paul, Miggy, Max Kepler, Labor Day, Blake Snell, you Darvish. Tarek Scooball, not a bad rookie. We'll put him up there. Clark Schmidt, Tristan McKenzie, and a chrome is Josiah Gray, number 69. Seth Beer. So we got a 69 and Beer right behind each other. <laughs> Oswald Peraza, Daniel Espinosa. We already seen him before. Another Garrett Mitchell. It's been a Garrett Mitchell night. We pulled chrome of him, a, a numbered card. Only thing we didn't get is an auto of him. But we got everything else that Garrett Mitchell just about. Uh, Royce Lewis, Edward Cabrera, Vidal Brujon, uh, Hunter Bishop, Adley, and Justin Foscue. Eh, not too bad of three cellos right there. Probably could have been a little bit better, but wasn't bad. Look closely at Kyle Lewis card if, if you get one. Total Photoshop cartoonish. I'm telling you, dude, if you look at this, if you were seeing this 
we'll look at it closer again. But Scooball, Nicobel, Sanchez, Jake Vogel, Ian Anderson, Adley Rushman, Josiah Gray, Luis Garcia, Luis Garcia, Reed Detmer, the Pipeline, the Braves, probably the best card you got. <laughs> Garrett Mitchell, uh, Joey Bart, and you see, look at that. You can't tell me that ain't Photoshop. Just look at his face. It don't even look like a real person. It looks like something you'll see like in a, a 3D type of like game. I just don't even, I mean, look at his, his arms even look different than his face. I don't know, maybe the way it's shining on him or something like that. Yeah. Just looks weird. I don't know. Looks like somebody. You have that Garrett Mitchell at James Palmer. I think he does, Paul, but you can ask him and see. You can ask him and see if he responds. He was on here a little while ago. He's still on here. <laughs> Anybody else when we call it tonight? Have you opened any UFC up at all? Um, Wayne T-Bone, you on there? Yeah, right out of the video game. That's what it looks like. Something out of, what was that, uh, um, what was that game called? Mortal Kombat or something like that. It looks like that guy that, that freezes you or has that little, I don't know what it is, that little, like, uh, hat. Go ahead and give the Mitchell to James Palmer. All right. Let's see if I can find it here. I know somebody gave him one tonight, which was this one. The camo one. Who gave it that? That was Derek. Derek gave him that one. So let me see here if I can find him. Right there he is. There he is. I'm sure he'll throw out some Ed Howard your way for sure. What am I doing? I can't write on that. Let's write on this. Yeah, let's do it like this. To James Palmer from the mayor. There we go. It's hard to get out of the sleeve so I can write on the dinner sleeve. I wasn't even thinking what I was doing. James Palmer got two Garrett Mitchells tonight, and Shalani got a number card, our only number that we you know, our second number would cool. Tom pulled that and gave that to Shalani. That was pretty cool. So, yep. Anything, oh, let me write down your cards here, Paul C. Paul C. If you haven't got your cards yet, Paul, you should be getting them in probably by Friday at least, if you haven't already. You're welcome, Mayor. You are welcome, buddy. I've opened up my cards tonight. We've got 11 on here. There's nothing else to open. I'm going to call it tonight. Might be a little quick pull. Quick pull. I'll clean up all these cards behind me that I got thrown everywhere. All the empty wrappers and everywhere. So, um, but yeah. Thanks, everybody, for buying in. If you want me to do it um, next week sometime, just let me know. If I grab some more Bowman, we'll definitely do it. seems like I need to get more cellos for sure because people love the chrome. Or not the chrome, but the uh, camos when it come out. So I'll see if I can grab some more of those for sure and put that in the group or something like that. So, yep. Uh, that's right. Monday. Everybody's off work Monday and everything. So, uh, Well, most people are. We'll put it like that. Yeah, are off Monday. Some still have to work. I'm actually off Monday. Um, so that'll be cool. Time to sort cards and maybe uh, grill out or something like that and maybe toss a couple back. Who knows? So, thanks everybody for stopping by. I'm going to go ahead and call it a night. Thanks again. And y'all keep on ripping Clark Sports Cards out. Good night, everybody.